All right, so what is good, everyone? Today is April, Tuesday, the 12th. Um, I haven't been open uh, to any of my subscribers or in any of my videos yet. That's why I'm making this video now before it's too late. Um, about me competing in my first ever NPC men's physique show, which is actually happening in about, um, right now, currently 10 weeks out from my first uh, NPC men's physique show, like I just mentioned. Um, the date is June 16th to the 18th um, in Chicago, which is the NPC uh, Super Junior Championships in Chicago. Um, I'm really excited about it. Like, this is my first time, so um, I wasn't sure, like, how to initially even start. Like, should I hire a coach? What should I do? Um, and I actually decided to just, like, go about it my own. Uh, I've been doing all my dieting, all of my, you know, workout splits and everything just by myself. Um, I mean, the one thing that I might ask for some assistance with is my posing. But even that, I think uh, I have a pretty good idea of what I'm doing so far. Um, like I said, though, that would be the one thing where I might, you know, want to reach out to someone for some help. But so currently, like I said, 10 weeks out, um, I kind of want to just go over where uh, I'm putting my maintenance at and everything. Um, so far, I started at uh, 2,700 calories and I drop every week uh, in calories. So now I'm on... 2600 and what kind of psyched me out not completely but like made me a little more weary of this whole thing is when I first started my prep I thought I was 15 weeks out but in reality I was actually 11 um I looked at the date wrong so um I was a little closer than I thought so uh I've been super consistent over the last two weeks and I've seen drastic changes in just overall areas of my body, uh, especially my core, that's where I really need to lose my, uh, like, last bit of, like, fat. Like, I don't have too much fat on my body right now. Like, I'm pretty lean um, in, like, my upper area, especially my arms. But uh, I carry, like, fat, like, right here, stubborn lower belly fat that I really got to get rid of. That's just been bugging me. But um, uh, I've been hitting uh, cardio about... <sighs> Right now, I didn't want to overdo it, but I've been doing um, around 200 to 300 calorie sessions around three times a week. And I also uh, play basketball as well on um, some other days that are just recreational days. Um, but actually, uh, what wasn't too good that uh, made me work out not... Uh, not it's I still worked out on these days, but um I hyperextended my wrist lifting a log at work. So that kinda fucking sucked. I, I was I wasn't sure how bad it was gonna be. Like when I first tried to go back to the gym, like I couldn't even like pick up a dumbbell like this, this way, this way, any really type of um push pull, so have you. I couldn't really do it unless it was with really lightweight or I was like using a machine press movements or you know pull or whatever um but um you know that's healed up I iced it a lot uh you know do a lot of stretching a lot of this rolls wrist rolls stuff like that so it's feeling a lot better so uh that's awesome because if I wasn't able to work out you know I don't know how well this uh this prep would go obviously I'm gonna be needing to stay consistent in the gym but um the cool part about this is two people actually competing. One of them is actually one of my best friends, uh, and I believe we're in the same height class. So we're going to be on stage together at the same time, and that is just going to be a really cool experience. Um, and then uh, one of my buddies from the gym that I go to, he's in a different height class, but he's competing at the same show. So it's just going to be an overall, like, just really cool and rewarding experience to share with two people I know and just all in all like no matter what happens I know I'm going to be in the best shape of my life at the end of it and regardless of you know how well I do even if I place um I'm going to get to eat some awesome food that <laughs> afterwards that's like what I'm most excited for is just like the rewarding feeling of okay this is over I can chill now 
I look great, and now let's just munch the fuck out on whatever I want. But, um, and I'm also gonna, you know, have a great kickstart to looking, you know, lean for the summer, which, um, is normally just my goal and just working out, you know, bulking through the year, look shredded during the summer and, you know, start it all over again. But now it's like I'm actually working towards something and, uh, I'm really excited guys, so um, I'm going to be uh, uploading some like full day of eating type stuff with uh, like kind of the stuff I'm eating for my prep. If any of you guys have competed before, a few of you guys, um, one in particular that I know of, um, just competed uh, not too long ago and um, so we can relate on some of the things like regarding prep and all that kind of stuff. But um, if you have any advice for those of you that you've competed before, um, feel free to drop a comment below. It would be much appreciated. Uh, but like I said, there's going to be like full day of eating vlogs, more so like in my workout. Like maybe not so many of the life stories right now. I'm just going to kind of focus on like prep type uh, videos coming out. Um, there will be a few life stories. But one person asked me if I had any prom life stories, um, which I actually never fucking went to prom. And, um, yeah, just wasn't uh, really a dance guy in high school. So, um, yeah, there will be no prom life stories. But um, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video here. Um, basically, just an explanation of where my next, like, two and a half months are going to be guided towards. And follow me along on this journey, guys. I'm super pumped. Um, so if you watched the video and liked it all the way through, uh, throw me a thumbs up. Drop a comment or a question below, and I'll be talking to you guys later. Keep that pump strong.